Hello, in this session we are going to look at the next stage which is your plan stage. So in the last session we looked at your validate stage which can be used to validate your Terraform code for any syntactical error or if you have the mandatory arguments or if you're using the right attributes or not. Now in this session we will look at the plan stage which can be used to generate a preview uh, to make sure if you are creating the right resources, we are using the right values before we create the resources. Once again, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. So let's get started with this. So once you're done writing the code, right, once you're done writing the configuration files or the Terraform code, we can make use of this stage to, gen to generate a plan or to generate a preview where we can validate uh, the resources. If Terraform is using the right values or not, how many resources it is going to create, all those um, verifications can be done by using this plan stage. So now for this, we can make use of this Terraform plan command. Now what, when we run this command, what this will do is this will generate a preview. Uh, basically all the actions that Terraform will do or it will execute to create the resources for us. So maybe it could be modifying the infrastructure or creating new resources. All that preview will be available for that uh, for us before we can create those resources. Now, the function of your Terraform plan is speculative. Uh, you cannot apply, basically you cannot create those resources unless you save the contents and pass them to the next stage, which is the Terraform apply command. So we will be talking about this in the next session. Now this command is just for the creation of a plan, all right? This does not create the resources for us. This will only create a plan which we can review or verify for the code that we have written. This does not make any changes to the existing infrastructure or to the deployment. So if you're not satisfied with the uh, preview, you can go ahead and update the configuration files and then generate the Terraform plan once again. So let's look at an example for this. Now here, this is the configuration file I have, my main.tf file that I have. Let me just uh, do this. And now what we will do is we will run this Terraform plan command. So what this will do is this will read our configuration files and it will generate a preview for us. So this is the preview that I was talking about starting from here. All right. So like I said already, this will not create or this will not change um, any resources for us. So you can see here it says plus symbol. That means that this is going to create some resources for us. If you see minus, that means Terraform is going to destroy some resources for us. And then we also have the tilde symbol, which is going to update or modify the resources for us. So here Terraform will perform the following actions and this resource will be created for us. So here you can validate a, what AMI we are using, uh, then what is the instance type we are using. And for most of the um, values, if you see it says known after apply, that means Terraform is telling, uh, I will know the values for this only if you execute this code. So likewise here, you can see for most of them, it says, it says known after apply, but that's the plan for me. And here at the bottom, you can see the final plan which says one to add so one means one resource will be created zero resources will be changed and zero resources will be destroyed all right now if you're not okay with this plan you can go ahead and modify your uh, code so let's say i want to use a different instance type so let's say i'll go with the medium so let's change this to medium Again, I'll save the configuration file and again, we will run the Terraform plan. So like I already said, this is just to generate a preview for us to verify whether Terraform is using the right values or not. And so here you can see the instance type is now pointing to t2.medium. So like this, we can make use of this Terraform plan stage to validate or to verify whether Terraform is creating the right resources, the right number of resources or not, whether it is using the right values or not, the right AMI, the right instance type, depending on the resources you are creating. This is where we can make use of the Terraform plan command. All right. Now, once you're okay with this plan, the next stage would be for us to execute this plan, which will create the resources for us. 
So in the next session, uh, we will look at how you can uh, create the resources uh, once you're okay with the plan. That's all for this session. Thank you. Once again, before you leave, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and uh, please like the video and please share the video.